Hi, Steve Ninnis from Maintenance Experts. What I want to talk about today is actually um, the closing of work orders and how it can shift your schedule around in your PMs and your activator. If your PMs are not fixed, okay, and remember I say for example I've got that one monthly, three monthly, six monthly, annual, two yearly PMs due on a pump. Okay, the three monthly is due. It's got a work order sitting out there. And what actually happens is we don't do that three monthly on time. Okay, say it was supposed to be done, you know, four weeks ago, but I actually don't do it until today. Okay, so I'm four weeks out of whack. Now, firstly, Mex would have already told the monthly not to be turned into a PR work order because of the fixed option. So fixed is off on these. And so what will actually happen is I'm now going to close this work order off for the three monthly, but I'm closing it off four weeks late. Than, later than what it said it was supposed to be done. What is it going to do? Okay, you, you'll see when you close a work order off, a little box pops up saying, do you know, do you want to update the last done date? And if you say, if you know, when this job was done, you say, yeah, it was actually done today, not four weeks ago, it was done today. What happens? Okay, you see all, we had the monthly, three monthly, six monthly, annual, two yearly. I'm making good use of my hand today, by the way. Um, the, you've got those five PMs, they were, if we now say this was done four weeks late, it pushes this and this and this all out by another four weeks. Okay, and this one here by another four weeks. So effectively by saying the three monthly was finished today, what's now going to occur is the monthly is going to occur one month from today. Okay, and all of these have now been pushed out further into the future as well. And what it's, so what it's, well, it's just allowing for the reality of how maintenance is done. It's saying, yeah, we should service every 30 days, but sometimes we can't because there's breakdowns, there's other things that go on. So when you close that work order off and you update that PM, that work order to say, this is what we, when we last did it, it then goes through the system and it changes all of them. Now remember, for this to work, Hierarchy must be turned on for all five of them. Also, fixed is turned off for all five of them. And by the way, that's the default setting inside every PM when you go to add it. And I hope that information is of use to you. So have a good day, bye.